You've heard of RPA, and now you're looking for the perfect place to start. Here are three ways that you can use RPA to maximize existing applications, business processes, and your team. Number one, use RPA to breathe new life into your legacy solutions that you can't reach with other forms of integration. Hopefully, replacing legacy solutions is on your strategic roadmap, but we know that that can take time. RPA can be used to pull in data from other applications or kick off processes by feeding data to the desired destination without manual or repetitive work from your team. Number two, if your business processes are a combination of simple tasks and tasks that require human intervention or judgment, you can combine RPA with other process automation tools like workflow and case management. These tools can work together to automate where possible and deliver knowledge work directly to your team at the same time. A great way to extend automation tools like workflow and case management is to use RPA to interact with third-party applications, websites, or portals. The robot can enter data previously gathered into a portal, download a report, or allow you to integrate where it could have been difficult in the past. Number three. Day-to-day -day system administration activities can be repetitive and take valuable, knowledgeable staff away from more important activities. For example, things like password resets. Using RPA to automate these activities, especially for large organizations, can add time back to your team's day and minimize disruption. RPA and automation are not here to replace people but rather to allow them to focus on activities that bring the most value to the organization. Be sure to comment and tell us how you're using or thinking of using RPA to extend your existing applications, automation, and your team. And if you'd like to talk through your ideas with an RPA expert, give us a call.